I'm Matt Bichard with REIT.com here in New York City for REIT Week 2015. Joining me for this CEO Spotlight is Bill Bayless, President and CEO of American Campus Communities. Bill, thanks so much for joining us. Morning, Matt. Let's start by talking about your company's development pipeline, which has been very robust and, and is slated to be so for the several years. Are there any commonalities to the types of locations or projects that you currently have in the works? Yes, there are. Uh, we currently have a $1.2 billion pipeline to be delivered in 2015, 2016, and 2017. Uh, about 50% of that pipeline is actually owned on campus properties, where we're actually located on the college campus in a joint in a partnership with the university, where we actually lease the land from them and privately own their on-campus housing. The remaining 50% of assets are all located inside of one-tenth of a mile to the university campus, uh, just across the street. So in all cases, all those assets allow students to literally roll out of bed and be in class in 10 minutes, which is one of the main advantages of living in an American campus community. On the acquisition side, how are you finding the transaction market, and are you also looking to dispose of some assets? It's a robust transaction market. Uh, if you look at 2014 that just ended, there were $3 billion of transactions in the student housing space, and the REITs only accounted for 8% of that, so a significant activity in the space. Uh, one of the more exciting things in our sector is that student housing cap rates actually compressed to within 12 basis points of the general multifamily market. That's down from 50 basis points in uh, 2014 and 53 basis points in 2013. And actually in Q1 of this year, for the quarter, they dipped under multifamily. So it shows the institutional demand for student housing assets. Uh, we've been a buyer of core assets, and we've also been a disposer of some of the properties that don't meet our long-term investment criteria. And so for the year, we've actually already closed over 400 millions in dispo that we're recycling into that $1.2 billion development pipeline. And lastly, we've talked in the past about the increasing role REITs will play in the U.S. student housing market. Where are we in that cycle, and how big a role do you think eventually the REITs will play? It can be a much larger role. And in our industry is still in its infancy. Uh, there's 280 target markets that we've identified in America. We're only in 72 of those markets. The top 25 owners of student housing control just about 6% of the addressable demand. And so the opportunity for growth for American campus and for other companies in the space is significant. And I think with that, you'll see more and more of the folks that may be currently private to see all the advantages that the REIT platform have brought to American campus and that they may consider also. So we think it's an expanding uh, segment within REIT world. Great. Bill, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Matt. For more on this and other REIT news and analysis, be sure to visit REIT.com.